Hey, what's up, everybody? Enan here from Udroid Mania with part three of my Android Tips and Tricks series, so let's jump right into it. Did you know that the Galaxy Note 8 has the ability to screen record any app? From the settings menu, tap on performance mode and then choose game mode and then apply. Now you can record your screen without the need to install an extra app. Just don't forget to turn it off when you're finished. Most of the day I'm heads down when working, so I like to get a visual notification when I get a text message. I do this using edge lighting. Again, from the settings menu, head into the display settings and scroll down until you see edge screen. Then choose edge lighting. Now I always like to show the lighting and only be notified by certain apps. You can pick what works for you here. There's other options as well, so be sure to check them out. Next, let's talk about that always on display. I mean, what's the use of having it on if you're not gonna use it, right? So I like to beef it up a little bit. Again, head over to settings, this time find lock screen and security and tap it. Scroll down to find information and face widgets and then click face widgets. You can select whatever you want to appear. I was asked how to turn on portrait or selective focus mode on the front facing camera. Simply slide from the left hand side to open the menu controls, then choose selective focus. Note that the camera is pretty finicky when using this mode. So you'll have to be precisely 20 inches away for the most part, or it won't work. Anyway, you can try it out. Lastly, as I mentioned, I'll be showing you how I theme my Note 8 in the final video of this series. I think this go round, I'm going for an all black theme. And if you plan on trying it out, you'll need Nova Launcher. So head into the Play Store right now and grab it. Along the way today, I've already given you an early look at where I'm heading. And of course, I'll have more in next week's video. Here's a sneak peek of where I'm going. Okay, so there you guys have it. In this series, I've given you 20 tips and tricks that can be used on your Samsung Galaxy devices. Let me know two things so I can decide what to do next. One, did you learn anything new from these videos? And two, do you want to see other videos like this on the channel? If you've enjoyed this one, do leave a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button now to join us here and help me get to 30K subscribers. Welcome to the channel. As always, I'd like to thank you for watching and I'll talk to you in my next one.